New York Living, Money Matters. I'm Monica Brown. These real estate agents get no salary, no health benefits. They don't even get their own desks. But when they make a sale, they keep the profits. At the end of the day, I'm taking home the entire commission. Kathy Braddock and her partner, Paul Purcell, started the Charles Ruttenberg Agency in New York two years ago. And while the real estate market is definitely tougher these days, Braddock says Ruttenberg is thriving because their model is different. While other firms can take a heavy percentage of what an agent sells, this one takes nothing. We have doubled people's income overnight. We have taken people who were struggling in the past, because real estate is a tough business, they can double their income here, and they've been able to save money, they've been able to pay for tuitions. It sounds silly, but it's really a wonderful thing to be able to help change somebody's life. Braddock says her agents pay the company $99 a month and then a transaction fee of no more than $2,000 when they make a sale. She says the savings on the commission trickles down to consumers looking to sell or buy because they have more bargaining power. The consumer wins because our agents have some flexibility within their own commission. So how is Ruttenberg making money if they're not getting a cut of each sale? Braddock says by keeping overhead low, her 198 agents can work from anywhere in the world thanks to the internet, and by advertising in bulk, which saves money. They pass that savings on to the agents who buy their ads themselves. Agents here say it's a supportive environment they can't always get somewhere else, despite giving up a piece of their pie. Sometimes you don't see that support back, meaning what is that traditional real estate firm actually doing for you. The agency is hoping to continue its entrepreneurial mission of helping agents grow their own businesses and the partners say in this economy their competitors may have to rethink their own models as well in order to stay afloat. In Manhattan, Monica Brown, New York One.